Hey kiddos, this is Miss Lewis, and in this lesson, I'll be showing you how to add three digit numbers using our place value strategy. In order to be able to add numbers using the place value strategy, you must remember how to write numbers in expanded form. Let's review writing the number 482 in expanded form. We know that the green 2 is in the 1's place, the blue 8 is in the 10's place, and the red four is in the hundreds place. So now let's talk about the value of each digit in the number 482. What is the value of the digit four in the hundreds place? Well, we know that that digit four in the hundreds place doesn't just mean four. It has a value of 400. What is the value of the digit 8 in the tens place? We know that that 8 in the tens place doesn't just have a value of 8, it actually has a value of 80. What is the value of the digit 2 in the ones place? Well, we know, because we're super smart mathematicians, that that 2 in the 1's place has a value of 2. So 482 written in expanded form is 400 plus 80 plus 2, which equals 482. Flex your math muscles because you are so awesome at writing numbers in expanded form. Okay, let's move on and try to add three digit numbers using that place value strategy and remembering how to write our numbers in expanded form. So first let's look at the addition problem 234 plus 162. So first let's focus on the number 234 and let's write 234 in expanded form. What is the value of the digit 2 in the hundreds place? Because we're super smart mathematicians, we know that the digit 2 in the hundreds place has a value of 200. What is the value of the digit 3 in the tens place? Again, since you're a super smart mathematician, you know that that digit 3 in the tens place has a value of 30. What is the value of the digit 4 in the ones place? And again, because you're a super smart mathematician, you know that the 4 in the ones place has a value of 4. So 234 written in expanded form is 200 plus 30 plus 4. Next, let's look at the number 162. What is the value of the digit 1 in the hundreds place? The digit 1 in the hundreds place has a value of 100. What is the value of the digit 6 in the tens place? The digit 6 in the tens place has a value of 60. What is the value of the digit 2 in the ones place? The 2 in the ones place has a value of 2. So now 162 written in expanded form is 100 plus 60 plus 2. So here we have just pulled apart our numbers based on the place value of each digit. So now we have our hundreds, our tens, and our ones. So now we are just going to add the ones together, and then the tens together, and then the hundreds together. So 4 plus 2 equals 6. Now let's look at the tens place. 30 plus 60 equals 90. And lastly, let's look at the hundreds place. 200 plus 100 equals 300. So now we have 
the total, the answer or sum written in expanded form. And we can now write that in standard form to give us our answer or our sum to this addition problem. So we have 300 plus 90 plus 6. So what is the sum of 234 plus 162? I want you to take just a second and try to give me the sum. If you said 396, you are correct. All right, let's try another example using the place value strategy. So our next example is 657 plus 321. First, we need to figure out what 657 is written in expanded form. The 6 in the hundreds place has a value of... Six hundred. The five in the tens place has a value of fifty. The seven in the ones place has a value of seven. So six hundred fifty seven written in expanded form is six hundred plus fifty plus seven. Now let's take a look at 321. The value of the digit 3 in the hundreds place is 300. The value of the 2 in the tens place is 20. The value of the 1 in the ones place is 1. So 321 written in expanded form is 300 plus 20 plus 1. So now that we have written both numbers from our addition problem in expanded form, we can add together the ones, the tens, and then the hundreds. 7 plus 1 is 8. Now let's add together our tens. 50 plus 20 is 70. And lastly, let's add together our hundreds. 600 plus 300 is 900. So now we have our answer or our sum written in expanded form, or we have shown the place value of each digit in our numbers. So 900 plus 70 plus 8 gives us our sum of 978. All right, kiddos. Thanks for watching. You have now learned how to add three digit numbers together using the strategy place value. Make sure you check out our website at eisthirdgrade.weebs.com. You can find this video on our website. And also for our learnings in class, follow us on Twitter at aklewis1147. Thanks for watching.